Hey guys, today we are going to talk about how to wash the dishes. We're gonna work on a little bit of sequencing. Before we get started though, um, if you're a teacher or a speech therapist, make sure you go and grab the um, companion worksheet that goes with this. It's over on TPT and I'll link it in the description for you. Okay, are you ready? Let's go. So when you are washing the dishes, the first thing that you need to do is you need to use hot water and make hot soapy water. So we pour the soap into the water and we're getting some nice bubbles. Um, we are using hot water because the hot water helps to kill all of the germs. Um, and that is also why we use the soap. So the hot water and the soap, when they work together, kill all of the germs that are on our dirty dishes. So I've got the hot soapy water in my sink and then I'm gonna get my rag and I'm going to wipe down the inside of my dishes. I'm gonna wipe them down really good to make sure I get all of the yucky food and all of the germs out of my dish. And then I'm going to rinse my dishes, once they're clean, or once I've washed them, I'm gonna rinse all the soap off with the water, and then I'm gonna put them on the mat to dry. All right guys, now that I have washed and rinsed off my dishes, I have put them on the mat so that they can dry. There they are, they are nice and dry, and now that they're dry, I'm gonna go and I'm gonna put them away. And it is always important to go and put your dishes away when you finish washing your dishes so that you clean up your mess and you don't leave a mess behind you and somebody else has to come up and clean up for you because that's not cool. So we have washed our dishes. If you remember, we got our soap, we made hot soapy water, and then we um, washed our dishes in the hot soapy water, got all the yucky stuff off, we rinsed them off with water, we let them dry, and then we cleaned up our mess and we put away the dishes. And that is how you wash the dishes. Hey guys, I know I mentioned this at the beginning of the video, but just in case you missed it, um, I wanted to let you know that there is a um, complete resource on TPT that has these sequencing activities in it. Um, the worksheets were designed to um, go as a perfect companion activity with these videos. So I know when I've tried to like, you know, work on sequencing in the past, I love using videos because it's a great visual, but um, the videos don't always match the visuals or the exact steps that I want to target as I am teaching these skills. So what I've done is I have made um, sure that these videos line up perfectly with the worksheets. Um, they're on TPT, the link is in the description if you want to add it. I think it would be a great supplemental companion activity um, as you teach sequencing.